In this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up your GMX email account with the Windows Mail app within Windows 10. So before you begin, you need to log into your GMX email account through your web browser. So just enter your email address and your password. And once you're on the main page, what you need to do, you need to click on more. Then you need to click on email settings. Then on the left hand side here you can see part 3 and IMAP, click on that. What you need to do, you need to ensure that this little box here, enable access to this account via part 3 and IMAP, you need to make sure that is ticked. So once that's ticked, you can then close that page. Then you can open up the Windows Mail app with the Windows 10. This app is either usually found on the bottom toolbar, like down here for example. If you can't find it there, click on the Windows icon in the left hand corner. Then scroll down to M for Mail, and you can see the Mail app there. You can right click on this and you can add it to the, to the taskbar or your desktop so for, for quick access. So open up the Mail program. If you're using this for the first time, you'll get a slightly different screen to set up your new, your new email account. If not, you need to click on the gear icon down here, settings, and then click manage accounts. Then you can click add a account. This is the page you'll normally get if you're setting up for the first time. So from here, you need to scroll right down to the bottom to advanced setup. Then you need to click on internet email. Now you need to enter your um, GMX email account, so your username will be exactly the same as your email address, so I'll just copy and paste this in place. Then enter your password. Then you can give your account a name, just call it GMX for example. Then you can enter your name, just say John for quick access. Now these are the important parts, incoming email server. For this you need to enter these details. I'll put these in the description so you don't have to um, remember them. So for the incoming email server is imap.gmx.com colon 993 colon 1 account type choose IMAP4 and for the outgoing email server you need to enter this for the outgoing is smtp.gmx.com colon 587 colon 1 I put those in the description so you can remember them so once all that's, all that's right for these, you can leave all these ticks. It actually recommends on the GMX website that you untick required SSL for outgoing emails, but it also works with the ticks, so I'm just going to leave all these ticked. So click sign in. This may take a few seconds. So click done, so you can now see a load of emails now appeared from my test account. So just to make sure your email account is working correctly, what I would do is cl click on new email and just send it to yourself, so just put something in the subject, anything and then click send to sit back and either wait for it to come in or you can click the little refresh icon up here, so if I click this it's giving me a certificate warning, but just, just, just click continue And then you can see it's now come through. Don't, don't worry about that warning, that's just a normal security feature. So basically, that's how you should do it. Once you can send and receive emails, you know it's set up properly. Just remember you have to log into your GMX email account and, and enable um, third party access to your emails through the, the Windows Mail app. So that's basically how you do it. Thanks for watching.